OK, welcome back to the Big Fat Quiz of Everything. The next round is all about film and TV. There have been some incredible movies over the last 50 years and The Phantom Menace and Cats. <laughs> the Flintstones first aired in the 1960s. It's modern-day people but living in a Stone Age world without cars, heating, TV, travel or technology. It's basically what life would be like now if Extinction Rebellion had their way. <laughs> Everyone knows Channel 4's Big Brother was inspired by the book 1984, specifically the part where Winston Smith gets fingered in the hot tub by Kinger. <laughs> <laughs> All right, time for some film and TV questions. OK, first up, it's a question about the Marvel Cinematic Universe. We all know that Spider-Man, the Hulk and Captain America have superpowers. All I want you to do is tell me how they got them. I'm um, Captain America. How did he get his powers? I think he, he got bitten by America. <laughs> Question two. As star of TV, film and O2 voiceovers, Sean Bean has done something on screen over 25 times. What is it? What's Sean Bean done 25 oh. times on screen? I'm joking. <laughs> I'm joking. I just lost his damn mind! <laughs> you filthy sod. You sit there, nice and yeah, you're tight, and here. you're whispering filth to Roisin <laughs> We're workshopping material, <laughs> Robert. <laughs> but out. We're workshopping <laughs> it. <laughs> and what there are no, there are no boundaries. Was there, there a little no tight hanging this down? Is you're sick, room. Room. <laughs> Robert, <laughs> Robert, get out. Robert, get out of the writing room. Can you bring back the dividers that we had when COVID first came in? Jimmy, can I ask Richard a question? Yeah, Richard. <laughs> Rob's got a question. Please, Robert. all I want to know is, please say, please say out loud what you said about Sean Bean to Roisin. What did I... you suggest that he did 25 this times? This is a closed writing room. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Richard, you've got to say. No, I don't. <laughs> this is very like, I was once on a school trip and they said I had to dance. I did not dance. <laughs> what did he say? He didn't dance, but did you ejaculate in your own mouth like Sean Bean did? <laughs> Close writing room, Robert. <laughs> Close writing room, Robert. He said that Sean Bean has ejaculated in his own mouth over 25 times on stream. <laughs> Rich, you do realise that some of this stuff we don't mean. <laughs> yeah, but I don't actually yeah. think KFC grew six inches. <laughs> okay, all right. Next question. The classic film Forrest Gump sees Tom Hanks pop up at famous and iconic moments throughout history. Can you name three of the famous people he meets in the film? Yeah. Forrest Gump. <laughs> OK, no further questions. <laughs> Can you name three famous people that Forrest Gump meets in the film? OK. Next up, Super Nanny Joe Frost hit our screens back in 2004. Can you tell me the famous piece of parenting advice that became her trademark phrase? Um, what was her phrase? I can't, I can't remember. I don't know what I never watched this. <laughs> oh, you'll know the phrase. <laughs> and lastly for this round, over to Yara Greyjoy herself, star of Game of Thrones, Gemma Whelan. Hi, Jimmy. As you know, I played the fierce warrior Yara Greyjoy in the hit series Game of Thrones. House Greyjoy is one of the nine great houses of Westeros. Can your teams name three of the others? Yeah. <laughs> OK, so name some houses from Game of Thrones. Okay. Ready for answers? OK, so I asked you yeah. how Spider-Man, the Hulk and Captain America got their superpowers. What did you get? First two, very easy. Rosie? Great spider. What, sorry? Just a spider, was it? Yeah. Yeah? Just a regular spider bit in. A magic? There'll be nerds crying at home. <laughs> a spooky spider. You can have bit by a spider, but bit by a radioactive spider. Jimmy, this is a problem. All spiders are spiders. Yeah. Don't separate them. Yeah. <laughs> okay, did you get this? Joanne? Yeah, the first one we got spider, yeah. And then, yeah, bitten by spider. You got this? Did yeah. they put radioactive spider bite? Yeah, nice. OK, okay uh, the Hulk, we all got the Hulk, right? Tantrums, we put. Tantrums. <laughs> that is his superpower, essentially. <laughs> like a toddler can do that, he's just gone mental. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he throws giant tantrums and... No? It's no. A great yeah. thing. I, got, it. I mean, it could be too much sugar. It's often that. Yeah. He gets angry, doesn't he? He gets angry and big and green and has a right old tear up. Yeah. He looks like the corn lad. What's your man's name? A jolly green giant? Yeah! <laughs> yeah um, what guy. did you write for this, Roisin, Richard? Serum after a car fell on his wife. <laughs> no! <laughs> Give um, positive feedback so I can grow. <laughs> <laughs> well, hang on, Roisin, if you want to see bad feedback, and um, one, you, you put how the Hulk goes powers? Well, we said what? join Twitter. 
We're going to get drawn into it and then you get really angry. <laughs> Spider-Man was a uh, radioactive spider. The Hulk is a gamma rays, wasn't it? What? Huh? What? What's that? What do you mean, what's gamma rays? But he rays? was trying to develop gamma a rays. serum to make himself more powerful because a car did fall on his wife. He was furious. <laughs> Can you stop saying that? Because that isn't what happened. <laughs> None of it happened, Jimmy. None of it actually <laughs> happened. <laughs> Why are you a historian? <laughs> okay, Captain America. What happened to Captain America? I think he was in some sort of war and they got ill and they were like, shit, we'll freeze him. <laughs> and then he... I think yeah. you're thinking of the abominable snowman. <laughs> that... <laughs> what have you got for this one, Rob? John? Army experiment. Army experiment is pretty damn close. You can have that. Great. And um, what did you put for this one? Plebiscite. <laughs> you think there was a plebiscite? A, a vote? Yeah. He was voted democratically to have... <laughs> superpowers? Yeah. <laughs> OK. Uh, I can tell you, Captain America was injected with super soldier serum, which oh. sounds like a euphemism, doesn't it? <laughs> That's what Sean Bean did 25 times. <laughs> <laughs> I asked you what Sean Bean has done on the big and small screen over 25 times. Richard Iwadi, what did you think? <coughs> we think he died on screen. And then I added from Chronic Wind. <laughs> <laughs> Moan? I was going to say beheaded, but then that's a bit specific, isn't it? So, okay. died. We've, ah. got, we've gone for died. Yeah. All right, so, I mean, he's died. I can tell you're all right. He has died an incredible 25 times, and some of them are spectacular. I'm going to show you extraordinary clips now from Lord of the Rings, Goldeneye and The Field. They're all mental. That's extraordinary. <laughs> God bless Sean Bean, he's amazing. Right. I asked you who Forrest Gump met in the film. What did you get? Sally Field. <laughs> Sally Field, the actress that played his mum in Forrest Gump. Yeah. <laughs> he did meet her. So you've gone Sally Field. Robert Zemeckis, he was a director. <laughs> <laughs> and who else? He was friendly to everyone, Jimmy. Yeah, yeah, everyone. He got a good rep on that. He wasn't so. hierarchical. <laughs> no. Why do we have to just give names as if some people are more important than others? Am I right? Yes. Then leave me hanging. <laughs> <laughs> OK, uh, Joanne, Rob, thank you. Well, so, we had uh, President Kennedy. Yeah. John Lennon. John Lennon. Yeah. And then Bubba Gump. <laughs> Bubble Gump. Bubba Gump. Bubba Gump. Yeah, OK, so two, two uh, okay. points for you. You got whoa, two. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Well, have you been to Toronto? Have you not been to Leicester Square in central London? <laughs> He's got a whole restaurant, Bubba Gump. <laughs> Oh, he's, he met the Apple guy well, didn't he? Steve Jobs. Well, he used to get money from Apple, didn't he? He was like, and I, you thought it was a fruit, fruit company, didn't you? Yeah, but that wasn't a scene in that film. It's my favourite film! OK, who did he, who did he make? So, Jay FK, John Lennon, Richard Nixon, Elvis. And um, uh, one was a silly Billy. No. He called <laughs> yeah. Jay Z. No. Jay Z. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry for having a bit of fun. You know how it is, Richard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh. Okay, so you get all three points oh, there. I mean, yeah. you could have had Elvis Presley, John F. Kennedy, Linda B. Johnson, John Lennon, Richard Nixon, Abby Hoffman, Dick Cavett, George Wallace, and Paul Bryant. I asked you what piece of child discipline advice super nanny Joe Frost became synonymous with. So what, what was the phrase? Come off it. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great phrase. Ah! Come off it. You think that was her parenting advice? And also, you'll never amount to anything. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Joanne, what did you put? Well, we paraphrased, uh, but we, it was something along the line, shut the fuck up, you're adopted, is what we were <laughs> <laughs> Rosie, the voice of reason. So it's either the naughty step yeah. or I will kill you. <laughs> you little, little shit. I can tell you, it is the naughty step. What? what? The naughty step. OK. Huh? My favourite thing about Super Nanny was the fact she can't pronounce the word acceptable. Her pronunciation of acceptable is unacceptable. Have a look. Oh, I don't know who that yes. kid is, but... That's amazing. If you've got right. a kid, do you put them on the timeout step or the third floor landing? 
I put him, I put him in the West Wing. <laughs> I put him in, go, go to the West Wing. Argue it out with the butler. <laughs> OK, Gemma Whelan asked you to name three houses from Westeros. Did you get all these? Yeah. 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 yeah Point for each. Yeah. 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 Go on, what'd you get, Rob? The Targaryen, Stark and Lannisters. OK, pretty good. My one. Stark, Rosa. Baratheon, Lannister. Yeah. Nice. What's the second one? I don't know. House of Gucci. <laughs> <laughs> what did you say? House of Pain. House of Gucci, <laughs> House of, of Pain, Pain House, House Party. Party. <laughs> And then another pun that we can't read anymore. We've, got, we've forgotten a joke. <laughs> Aaron, Stark, Baratheon, Tully, Greyjoy, Lannister, Tyrell, Martell and Targaryen. Yeah. Martell, I don't know. OK, now it's time for a special bonus round. I'm going to show you three iconic TV characters who have all been given a handsome makeover. All you need to do is tell me who they are. Here is the first one. <laughs> is that a real person? Yeah. Sorry. Who was well, how, it? Uh, this is after they've been given What do you mean, who is it? I'm asking you, who is it? Is it, is it oh! and giraffe? Yeah! It's an iconic <laughs> TV character. All right, so that one, here's the second one. Oh. Wow! Who's not... the guy? <laughs> That's me with frosted tips. All right. I am not against it. <laughs> yeah. oh, I, need, yeah. I need help! <laughs> OK, and here's the last one. Enjoy. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> that's me pre hair wow. transplant. <laughs> okay, you've all got answers. Okay, so the first one, this is pretty easy. Who was that? We've got Susan Boyle or Columbo. <laughs> Susan Boyle or Columbo. I can tell you your. Um... What did you write for that? Age, give me Oh, you've had a howler here, Rosie. <laughs> They photoshopped oh. Jimmy's face on all three of them, and you've yeah. got to look beyond the face. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what, what did you answer for this? Columbo, Peter oh, Falk. Peter Falk. Let's have a look. Let the transformation, there it is. It's pretty good. It was pretty it. Pretty good transformation. Next one, OK, so who was that? Wham! That? Huh? Yeah. You think that's Wham? The famous <laughs> TV icon, Wham. I think it's Pat Sharp. Pat Sharp? Yeah. OK, let's go to Roisin. It's Jason Donovan. Yeah. It was Jason Donovan uh, as Scott Robinson. <laughs> Yeah. You didn't understand what this round was. <laughs> OK, and the, I think probably the best answer on this one, let's go to Rosie for this last one. Who do you think that was? Gokenberg! <laughs> yeah, that is true. Gokenberg. No, it was not yeah. Gokenberg. It's not Gokenberg. And then Rosie edit Poirot. OK, so Poirot, what did you...? Ratatouille. <laughs> <laughs> Again, for my better judgment, but we went with it. Yeah. Yeah. OK. <laughs> and Poirot, you got this, Richard? Poirot, Richard. straight facts. OK. All right, let's see what that's done to the scores. I can tell you, in last place, uh, Richard and Roisin have 11. They're lucky to have 11. What? Uh, oh, Joanne and Rob have 15. In the lead, Rosie and Mawan with 16 points. Oh,